Okay, it's beer o'clock again on the Real Ale Guide. Today's beer is a beer from the Allendale Brewery and it is their Golden Plover Real Golden Ale. Just off the back of the Wagtail Ale from Allendale Brewery. This is the Golden Ale. Now, I mentioned in the last review, if you watched it, that it's bird themed. They seem to like their birds or their wild birds at the Allendale Brewery and there's a reason for that excuse the water on the glass I'll just give it a quick rinse from the previous beer yeah but there's a reason for them to like or, or to be interested in wild birds in the area because they I believe from what I'm reading on the internet that they're near or they're on a moor a lot of wild animals and creatures and birds and stuff so they must have a lot of wagtails and golden plovers around in the area. This is a one finger head, it's very golden. Look, I'm going to stand out of the way and just show you that beer. How pretty is that? It's a very very nice looking beer, loads and loads of nice carbonation rising from the middle of the glass. Wow, that is crystal clear. Let's get a nose on the beer then. Slightly spicy nose on this one. A hint of honey and toffee. Oh, it smells wonderful. I'm going to have to dig in. Cheers everyone. Very light. Extremely light, extremely drinkable beer. There's a flavour which I'm just trying to grasp in here, but it's very malty. It's, it's citrusy hoppy, but in a in a very British citrusy hoppy kind of way it's a very at this moment in time I'm saying it's a very sweet honey it is a very sweet honey in this beer but I'm really, really thinking on this one because there's something in this beer. Do you know when you remember a friend's name? You see a friend across the room, maybe you're in a pub and he comes in and you go, What's your name? What's your name? It's that moment there where I know exactly what I'm tasting, but it's a bit, of a bit of mental brain loss I've got, of which I just can't quite put a flavour to the beer. It's a sweet honey. It's lemony. With a malt. When you get them honey shreddies. It's a little bit like that Honey Shreddies, if you've tried the Honey Shreddies, the breakfast cereal. It's kind of like that. Above all else, as I mentioned as I, as I started to review this beer, the biggest thing for me is how lovely and refreshing it is. It's a, it's a classic golden, golden ale. Pardon me. Now this one, this beer, unlike the Wagtail, the Wagtail had a really nice kind of classic bitter pull on the end, Tr classic traditional British pull. This one 
is it's less it's it it's hoppy but it's fruity all at the same time it's more of a fruity hop it's not a it's not a real bitter kind of finish on the beer it's very nice though very refreshing amazing what they can do it's 4% if I haven't mentioned it before it's 4% ABV there is so much so much flavour from this beer it's absolutely it just gets me every time that you can get so much out of a beer that's 4% the reason why I'm impressed with that is as you probably all know and I mention it a lot is I like to session beer I like to go out and have 5 or 6 pints drink 5 or 6 bottles over an evening over a day over an hour it's a Sunday afternoon here I intend to sit in my garden after these reviews and I've still got bits of beer left from other reviews crack a few more bottles open and just relax for the afternoon that's how I like to drink my beer so for me to get a beer of 4% ABV let me just show you there you go with all them wonderful flavours it just it just impresses me it really does okay it's www.allendalebrewery.com check them out our multi award winning golden ale made using the finest Maris Otter malt for a clean refreshing taste the beautiful golden plover is a common sight on the Allendale moors if you are quiet and know where to look there you go brilliant Brilliant, brilliant beer. Rating right then, the Golden Plover. I gave the Wagtail Ale a 7 out of 10 because of his bitter qualities and because of his, his, his was more of a classic kind of British bittersweet beer. This one's different. This one's um, more of a um, kind of a tutti fruity, honey, shreddy kind of honey shreddy kind of beer, which with citrus notes, hints of lemon, hints of grapefruit. I think it's brewed with halatai. Is it halatai hops? Um, for that reason, I'm going to join it with the Wagtail Ale. I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. Sorry, carbonation. 7 out of 10 from the Real Ale Guide. Um, both very good beers. If you manage to see the Allendale Breweries beers or go on their website, I believe you can order online. They're probably worth a go, I'd say. They're, they're, they're quite good. If I was in the area, I would certainly look to session these beers. If I was to holiday up in the area on the moors, I'd be saying... If I've seen them in a pub, yes, I know they're, they're what I want from a beer. So for that reason, 7 out of 10. Thanks for watching this edition. Put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe if you like and cheers.